New York City, a living tapestry woven from countless threads, its architectural fabric a testament to the city's rich and layered past. From the modest beginnings of Dutch colonial settlements to the soaring skyscrapers that define its modern skyline, New York's buildings narrate a captivating story of ambition, innovation and cultural evolution. Each era has left its indelible mark, creating a dynamic cityscape where architectural styles converse across centuries. As we navigate this urban landscape, we encounter remnants of bygone eras juxtaposed against contemporary masterpieces. The Dutch gambrel roofs peek out from beneath the shadows of towering structures, while stately federal-style buildings stand as proud reminders of the nation's nascent years. This essay embarks on a journey through time, tracing the evolution of New York City's architecture. Our exploration commences in the 17th century with the arrival of Dutch settlers who established New Amsterdam. They brought with them architectural traditions that were practical and reflective of their homeland. Buildings were primarily constructed from wood and brick, readily available materials that lent themselves to simple, sturdy structures. Dutch colonial houses were characterized by their distinctive gambrel roofs, a design element that maximized attic space while providing stability against the elements. Dormers, small windows projecting from the sloping roof, provided light and ventilation to the upper levels. These charming homes with their steep roofs and symmetrical facades dotted the landscape of early New Amsterdam. The American Revolution ushered in a new era, not only for the nation, but also for its architecture. The federal and Georgian styles embraced as symbols of American independence and aspirations swept across the newly formed United States. In New York City, these styles found expression in elegant buildings characterized by their symmetrical facades, Palladian-inspired doorways and restrained ornamentation. Red brick emerged as a favored material, lending a sense of warmth and permanence to these structures. Federal and Georgian buildings exuded an air of order and refinement reflecting the Enlightenment ideals upon which the nation was founded. They stood as proud symbols of a young republic eager to establish its identity. Section 4. Architectural Icons Francis Tavern and Federal Hall Among the notable examples of federal architecture in New York City, Francis Tavern and Federal Hall stand as prominent landmarks. Francis Tavern, a former residence turned tavern, witnessed pivotal moments in American history. It was here that George Washington bade farewell to his officers after the Revolutionary War. With its distinctive gambrel roof and Flemish bond brickwork, Francis Tavern embodies the transition from Dutch to federal styles. Federal Hall, originally constructed as New York City Hall, served as the first Capitol building of the United States. It was within its hallowed halls that George Washington took his oath of office as the first president. Designed by Pierre Charles L'Enfant, Federal Hall's imposing facade adorned with a grand portico and a dome inspired by the Pantheon in Rome, exemplified the grandeur and aspirations of the newly established nation. Section 5. Shifting Skylines. From Brownstones to Skyscrapers. As the 19th century progressed, New York City experienced unprecedented growth and transformation. The rise of industrialization and the influx of immigrants fueled a demand for housing and commercial spaces. Brownstone row houses with their distinctive reddish-brown sandstone facades became synonymous with New York City living. The late 19th and early 20th centuries witnessed the dawn of the skyscraper era. Advances in steel frame construction and elevator technology allowed architects to reach for the sky, literally. The iconic Flatiron Building, completed in 1902, marked a turning point in New York City's architectural history. Its triangular shape, clad in limestone and terracotta, soared above its neighbors, heralding a new era of verticality. Section 6. A legacy etched in stone and steel. From the modest Dutch colonial homes to the soaring skyscrapers that pierce the clouds, New York City's architecture reflects the city's ever-evolving spirit. Each generation has left its mark, adding new layers to this architectural tapestry. The city's buildings stand as tangible reminders of its past, embodiments of the dreams, aspirations and challenges faced by its inhabitants. As we marvel at the architectural diversity that defines New York City, we are reminded that its story is still being written. 
New buildings continue to rise, pushing the boundaries of design and innovation. Yet, amidst this constant evolution, the echoes of the past resonate, reminding us that a city's architectural heritage is an integral part of its identity. New York City, a testament to the enduring power of architecture to shape and reflect our urban landscapes.